Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to this video about the terminal. So you should have installed Visual Studio Code by now. And now it's time for us to open the terminal uh, the integrated terminal in Visual Studio Code. And you can do that by pressing Control Backtick. As you'll see right now, my terminal just opened. And um, I've got a couple of commands that we will be using a lot throughout this course. Uh, and that's why I want you to, to learn them as well. Um, in fact, you could do all this because these commands are simply showing what files are in a directory and, and changing directories and making a directory. You could also do that by just clicking on open folder and then you will get your, your default Windows File Explorer window. And you can do it from there as well, but I recommend you to use the um, command line in your terminal. So. Uh, you know, it, a terminal is simply a way to, to use your computer uh, through the command line. I can just type stuff right here. Um, so right now I'm in the root of my uh, PC. So if I press LS, um, it will show all um, like the, the documents folder, music, videos, and so on. Like all the default Windows folders. Now, I want to make a new directory because I want to keep my code in a, in a place where I can find it back. So I would say make there, make directory, and I will call it react course. As I press enter, now if I press ls, which stands for list files, you will see that here we go, we got a new directory react course. I can go into that directory by typing cd, change directory react and see what happens if I press tab it will autofill it for me so that's pretty nice so now I'm inside react course and what I can show you now is for example if we make a new directory we call it directory a and another one directory b now if I type ls it will show me the two directories um, so we can go also, for example, in directory A, we could say change directory A. And now you can see if I press LS, there are no files in there. And if I want to go back, I can do change directory dot dot. And that will bring me in the previous directory, at least the, the directory one level deeper. Um, but for now, I will remove the, the other directories. So I can say remove, remove force directory A and directory B. Press enter, list files, and it should be cleared up by now, as you can see. Um, so play a little bit with um, making some folders and navigating through um, through your Windows, uh, Windows Explorer. And if you get the hang of it, uh, I would like to see you in the next video.